Hey Shannon and James, uh, thanks for taking the time to watch this video. So what we're going to do is go over three things that you guys can do or have done that will help increase traffic flow to your website and thus get you more customers. So without further ado, I'm going to go ahead and jump right in. So the three things that you, you really want to cover are content, citations, and backlinks. Of course, there's many more nuances, but these are three big hitters that will really help um, increase the traffic flow to your site. So First off, I want to say you guys have a beautiful website. It looks real nice, professional. It's great. And you have a decent amount of content. In general, Google's looking for about 1,500 words of content or so on a page in order to rank uh, for various keywords. So when someone searches for a keyword or a phrase like electrician Nashville, Tennessee, Google crawls all the different pages in on the web or on the web to determine what websites are going to come up and what websites have the most um, relevant terms. So making sure you have those terms in there is a very important part of ranking. So uh, doing the keyword research is big and making sure you have enough content for Google to determine that your site is actually an electrician's website. So uh, content is big. I did Google electrician Nashville Tennessee which is a pretty big keyword. Uh, 320 people search that a month. So as you can imagine, there's quite a bit of business that comes from that particular phrase. And of course, anytime you change anything in here, that changes the keyword. So generally you have ads up at the top, which is a great way to get customers quickly if you're in need of uh, jobs right away. The next thing that pops up is the map pack. The map pack here in order to rank in it, you need to have more citations than your competition. So what is a citation? A citation is your name, address, phone number, and website URL being listed in a directory. What's a directory? A directory is a list of businesses like Yelp, uh, White Pages, things of that nature. Anywhere someone can go to get a list of businesses. So the second major thing to rank in the map pack here is ranking in the organics. All that means is just ranking naturally on a regular web page here. So how do you rank here? So everybody wants to know, right? The million dollar question. Well, content is big like I was just going over. The next thing is backlinks. So before we dive into backlinks, we're going to just take a look at some of these, your, your competition here, and see why they might be outranking us. So they do seem to have a lot more uh, content on their page so that's going to be a huge impact and something else to just mention while we're on the page is how you save your your uh, images is a big deal you know they don't have anything saved here so uh, the title and the, the information embedded in it it's a great way to uh, put in keywords and things of that nature so I had another one pulled up one thing I like about their website is they actually have a form to fill out right away. Uh, it's a great way to increase your your uh, lead input. So just because someone comes to your site doesn't necessarily mean they're going to call you, but making it easy is a great way to do that. They also have uh, quite a bit of content on here, but I think you might have them beat. Anyways, adding some more content and making sure it's quality content with the keywords is, is very big. All right, so I've got this tool here called Arifs. What it does is looks at the back end. So there's two scores that we really look at. You are, which is like what your page is about. Like, are you a plumbing website? Are you an electrician? What, what are you? The higher this is, it's out of 100. Both of these are out of 100. The higher this is, the more uh, Google believes that you are what you say you are. So 19 out of 100 is okay. Uh, definitely could do better on that. The DR is the, the power ranking or how popular your site is in Google's eyes. And you're 1 out of 100. So the higher this is, the more Google's going to crawl your site and see what kind of words you have on there, what kind of content. That way you can be found for more things and thus be rated higher in all the different searches. So how do you get this up? Well, you have backlinks. So what's a backlink? A backlink is a link from one website to another. So if you've got a article on you in a news organization saying you guys are excellent, that's going to carry a lot of weight and help bring up your site as long as they have a link from their site to your site, which would be one backlink. A backlink from a blog that nobody ever reads is going to carry a lot less weight than something from a news station or something like that. 
So uh, I did pull up your competition here. As you can see, they're a lot more powerful. They don't have as much um, power in there. You are, but it's still decent. Same thing with this high powerful or popular website. So they're able to be found for more things. Um, but adding more backlinks to your site will definitely help increase that. So just to recap, adding good quality content, adding more citations on your business, and then adding more powerful backlinks will help increase your overall ratings in Google. Well, Shannon, James, I hope you thought this was useful. If you don't mind, just give me some feedback. I'd really appreciate that, and I'll be reaching out to you soon to, uh, to go over it. Thanks.